Currently today, 700 million people live in extreme poverty. This means they don't have access to simple things that we take for granted, such as shelter, food, water, energy, somewhere safe to live. And humanitarian engineering is trying to help these people. It's using engineering and the tools and skills we provide as engineers to benefit the lives and livelihoods of those most in need. There's been a big change in how we try and help low and middle income countries um, achieve the sustainable development goals um, and improve the lives and livelihoods of the people living there. Humanitarian engineering is about working with those people in need, understanding what their priorities are, understanding what the knowledge and the existing information is, and then working with them to develop a solution that's both sustainable and appropriate. If you're the kind of person that likes challenges, likes travelling, likes exposure to other cultures and working in other languages, like making an impact, then humanitarian engineering is likely for you. In this area of engineering, it's important to me that we bring together hands-on and practical aspects as part of the exposure here at UNSW. So students can incorporate humanitarian engineering into their degree in different ways. If they wish, they can do a complete minor in humanitarian engineering to complement their Bachelor of Engineering degree. They can do a Fundamentals of Humanitarian Engineering course to understand the basics. They can travel overseas with funding from the new Colombo Mobility Plan. They can do the Humanitarian Engineering Project course. They actually get to build and hands-on develop a solution in partnership with a real-world partner. It's not all technical. There's a big part of it that is working with people, is about communicating, it's about developing those relationships, and it's about problem solving as a team. The projects that we have, where we have the hands-on approach, um, is working with real in-country partners overseas. We have projects in Kenya, Uganda, Fiji, the Solomon Islands, in Vanuatu, in Myanmar, in Vietnam, Cambodia, many, many places. Studying this at UNSW allows you to build your hands-on skills in developing real-world solutions. This will benefit both your educational experience and degree here at the university, as well as when you step out into the real world.